All right, folks. So old school BMX rider here, and uh, I just wanted to share a little something I learned with you guys. Here I have an old set of AME replica grips off of a 1985 Takara Power Moves. I got it, and when I got it, the grips look like that everywhere. Like the nastiness you see in those holes was the whole grips. I'll insert a picture here. So, what I'm going to share with you today is how I clean old white BMX grips to get them not looking necessarily new, but clean. First off, what I did was <clears throat> I soaked them in a jug of hot soapy water for about two hours. After that, I took a Mr. Clean Magic Eraser to them and got everything off of the surface, all the nastiness off the back of the flange, all the stuff off the front, off the outside of these ribs here, you know, like these ones. And then after that, you have to clean the inside of the holes. Well, that's a pain in the ass with a magic eraser. So what I figured out was actually the easiest way to go about it is since the, the rubber gets really soft when it's sitting in that hot water, you take a Q-tip, see if I can find a dirty one left on here. Ah. So see those right, right there? And how they got some dirt in them still you just stick your q-tip in here do a little circle and she's clean do a little do a little circle it's clean do a little circle clean do a little circle clean and you just go through all of these and you want to do it right after you've uh you just stick the q-tip in the hole and get her done and you want to do that while it's still pretty soft because that makes the edges of these triangles pliable to where you can get all the way to the edges. Otherwise, you end up with little black spots in all the corners like that that you have to do. Hello, guys. Here we are again with my AME replica grips off of my 1985 Takara Power Moves. And as you can see, these are not as good as new, but definitely clean and ready to go back on the bike. So I don't have to get replacement grips. I can keep the originals on there, looking good, looking nice, kicking ass. So, with just a little bit of elbow grease and some patience, you can have these results as well. Thank you. Remember to like, comment if you feel the need to say something. Definitely subscribe so you can see anything I bring to you in the future. And share these videos so I can get more people watching them. Gives me more motivation to get more made. Thank you. Everybody have a great day. Man, this is starting to get out of hand a little bit. I've got frames all over the place. i got complete bikes. i got buckets full of parks. i got mags. i got everything. But, now, I got... So here we are. Got my AME replica grips back on the Takara. You can see they're shining bright and looking good. And that means that I can keep the bike all original except for the wheel set keep it nice I'm gonna have to repaint this seat post and hopefully be able to find either a replica sticker or tape that one off paint around it but that seat post is the last real eyesore on this bike other than the wheels and I've already got my white checkered chain for it it's got a beautiful dominator beautiful ACS headset on it or excuse me gyro on it with a ACS uh, freestyle headset so this thing is ready to rock, and uh, I'm really glad I can keep those grips. This is a bike I want to keep as original as possible, so thank you for watching, and stay tuned.